Hey y'all, welcome back to our channel, 541 Miles. It's Kirsten, and in case you guys didn't know, Halloween's kind of my favorite time of year. So here's some costume inspiration just to kind of help you out this time of year. I really like using pop culture references as Halloween costumes just because they can be super quirky and unique, especially depending on some of the parties that you go to. Uh, so this is a really easy costume that anyone can really find in their closet or even at Goodwill. All you really need is a yellow sweater and jeans, but so the costume wasn't so plain, I also put my hair in two small buns to kind of look like Arthur's ears. I definitely remember dressing up as a Powerpuff Girl when I was younger for Halloween, so this is a throwback to back in the day when the Powerpuff Girls were super huge for me. So really you just need a basic pink dress, and instead of a literal black band going through the dress, like in the cartoon, I opted for a simple black choker. So this is definitely a play on pop culture and high fashion, specifically the Calvin Klein ads. It also follows the Mean Girls rule of underwear turning into the perfect costume. Obviously, this one may be a little more difficult to recreate, but I love Steven Universe and especially the character Garnet, so I had to throw it in here. So if you're really pressed for a bodysuit, you can always opt for focusing on some other things like Garnet's signature hair, her sunglasses, and even kind of getting into your makeup and doing the eye that she has in the center of her forehead. So for anyone who doesn't know a ton about Glossier, um, they're a makeup and skincare brand and they're really focused on sort of natural beauty and having a nice dewy finish. This look was a recreation from Refinery29's article on simple costumes for lazy girls. I love how simple this look is and it really almost entirely relies on the sort of makeup aspect and being in just your natural state. For my face, I just did a super full brow, kind of a staple for my makeup routine anyway, and then I went overboard with my Glossier highlighter, and everywhere I put highlight, I added a thin layer of Vaseline. And if you want a more exaggerated glossy look, I also put a pastel glittery pink lip gloss on my lips and on my lids to give a little bit of color. Thanks for watching and remember to comment and like and subscribe for more content. Happy Halloween! Bye!